Well, CBS3 Summerfest will be in Stone Harbor and Avalon today. Some of us like to spend a summer day relaxing by the water. Right, and then there are those of us who are ready to dive right in. Q Eyewitness News reporter Pat Gallen. He's live at Island Water Sports in Stone Harbor. Good morning, Pat. Good morning, Jim and Jan. Yeah, what do you do when you come to the Jersey Shore, specifically Avalon or Stone Harbor? Well, you come to Island Water Sports and you get to play on their amazing Aqua Park, or you can go a little bit deeper like I did, and you can try your hand at water skiing or flyboarding. This is what happened. Need something fun for the summer? Island Water Sports in Stone Harbor has been keeping kids and parents happy for 29 years. What are you doing? Paddleboarding. Is it fun? Yeah. It's a good workout, right? Yeah. What's the best part of being out there? Uh, the water. Just the water itself? Yeah. Um, doing the thing, the yeah. floaty thing. Have you been out here? Uh, no. Why not? <laughs> it would take me a week to recover from that thing, trust me. In addition to the aqua park and paddleboarding, two of the more extreme activities are water skiing and the flyboard. We began on the skis. First time, never done it. Give me some tips and tricks. Awesome. So basically, we're going to get you out on the boom first, and that's going to give you the feel for it. You're going to make sure to keep your knees bent, your arms straight, and your butt back. Sounds easy, right? Not so fast. After several tumbles, doing awesome. I found my footing. Yeah! There we go. Awesome. Keep those on straight. Yes, you're doing great. Yeah. Oh, saved it. After a strong finish, back to calmer waters and time for the flyboard. Hunter showed me how to get up. So as soon as the board is underneath you and you feel like it's vertical, stand straight with stand your legs and then arise up. If you come up with bent knee, you'll start to get pushed back. Using water power from a jet ski, I was propelled nearly 20 feet above the bay. Pretty or not, it was a blast. So thank you to Island Water Sports for letting me have fun earlier this week. And the flyboarding, I've got to admit, is really cool. Now the water skiing took a little bit of time to get used to. I finally did get up, but there are some war wounds, if you will. I mean, take a look. This is what happens, Jim and Jan, when, you, uh, when you're not great at water skiing. You get nasty bruises all over your legs. So. Uh, I'm still licking my wounds from that, but all in all, a great time. So if you are down here in Avalon or Stone Harbor, you've got to come by Island Water Sports because this thing is awesome as well. There are like 100 kids out here, some bigger kids as well, uh, but it's a, it's a blast down here. So I'm sure Jim and Jan, you guys would love to get out on the water skis. Am I, I would right? like the flyboard. Yeah. I would like the fly. I was wondering why you're walking like a little old man yesterday. <laughs> now we can see why. Now we know. War wounds. <laughs> I'm telling you. Good Thank stuff. Pat. Thanks, Pat. <laughs> yeah, well, stay sure. with Eyewitness News as we continue to spotlight the fun at the shore. Summerfest continues at 5 o'clock today with Jessica Dean, Tori Woodle, and Lauren Casey. You can see what makes Avalon and Stone Harbor such fun places to visit.